Hey, I'm Lindsey Thomas with QDMA, and I've got a quick tip for you that'll come in useful this fall when you're planting your cool season food plots. I wanna talk about the angle of your disc harrow discs relative to the direction in which you're pulling them through the food plot. The angle has an impact on the application and what you're doing to the soil as you disc that soil. Most disc harrow sets, like this small version for ATVs or UTVs, and the larger version over here for tractors, the three-point hitch version, they allow you to adjust the angle of the disc gains relative to the direction of travel. And what that does is adjust the aggressiveness of the disc and how much it digs into the dirt. We've got these heavier disc arrows set on a pretty aggressive angle. You can see that the disc arrows are turned at a pretty hard angle to the direction of the tractor. This is gonna let the disc arrows really dig in deep and get down below the surface of the soil you might want to use that in a situation where you are turning new ground, breaking a new food plot, and you really need to turn under the existing vegetation that you have sprayed. Or, for example, in a case where you're plowing a fire break around an area you're going to burn. Now, on this ATV model uh, disc arrows, we've got the angle set a lot uh, less aggressive. Um, and that, that is not going to let the disc arrows dig in very hard. They're just going to lightly turn the soil. And you might use that in a situation where your seed bed is already well prepared and you just want to lightly cover some seed that you have broadcast out there. There are disadvantages to aggressively disking. For one thing, you may be pulling weed seeds that are buried deep to the surface where they're going to germinate and create a problem for you where they weren't creating a problem before. For another thing, if you have crop residue on the surface, you're burying that crop residue deeply when you aggressively disk. That crop residue does the most good for you on the surface where it's helping conserve soil moisture and also as it breaks down and filters down into the soil, that's increasing organic matter and soil fertility. On the other hand, lightly disking has disadvantages as well, particularly if you're planting a crop that has a large seed like corn or soybeans or peas or some of the cereal grains. Those larger seeds need good soil contact to germinate. And if you disk too lightly, you're not covering enough of those seeds and you're not gonna get a good germination rate. So this fall, when you're planting your food plots, think about the application and your goals and adjust your disc angles accordingly to get the job done. For a lot more information on food plots and what to plant this fall and other guidance, visit us at QDMA.com.